It's about what you get out of it. It's about what you put into it. It's it, that's what it's all about. It don't matter who you are. Uh, as long as you like this shit is hard. It is difficult. Like life is difficult. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to another episode of React Attack. I am Ords, and today we are taking a look at the latest drop from Tom McDonald and Adam Calhoun off of the Brave 2 album, which just dropped. Go check that out. I believe it's on YouTube Music, and I think you can buy physical copies of it still, and I think they're only releasing so many. So if that's something you guys want to purchase, go check it out. Um, we'll probably leave a link somewhere. But yeah, uh, the Brave 2 is out. With that being said, this is the latest drop from these guys. This is Race War. But before we dive into this, I did want to apologize uh, that I have been doing reactions uh, in the last like week or so been super busy doing some other things behind the scenes been working on some music myself uh so just been kind of consumed with that but we're back to it we got to react to this this is race war now i think this just tracks obviously going to be super spicy there's gonna be a lot going on here um and let's just let's just see you know you think of the the tom song names uh and it'll kind of be in that vein you know what i'm saying so um uh, let's take a look. This is Tom McDonald and Adam Calhoun from the Brave 2 album Race War. Let's go. It's okay to be racist. As long as you hate on the Caucasians. Teaching white kids that their huh. shades the same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I'm... Whoa, hold on right out of the gate. Jesus. As long as you hate on the Caucasians. Teaching white kids that their shades the same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I'm tripping because the white children have been getting taught that they got white privilege by the white guys in the high heels who identify as the white women. On proud... I mean, whoa. Damn! I mean, like, dude. White children have been getting taught that they got white privilege by the white guys in the high heels who identify as the white women. I'm not proud to be white, but I'm fine with it because I'm not allowed to have pride in it because the colonizers and the white biggest made white history my business. I ain't never going to give a damn if you like me. I ain't going to trip when they stereotype me. I'm a white boy and a white boy like me knows that all lives matter. Fight me. When I was younger, they taught me to never see color. Damn. Damn. Damn, Tom. Holy shit, dude. He's fucking spitting. This Brave 2 album is like... I think he's really, like, challenged himself to to just kind of bring it, at least with uh, the, the rap itself, like, the way he flows. But, um, you know, here's the thing, man. Like, people believe what they see on the news, right? And what is the news show but a bunch of bullshit, man? That's why I don't even watch the news. I just formulate my own opinions based upon what I experience out in the world, man. Um, <clears throat> and what I see. Uh, on the internet and i mean this is what he's saying i mean there's a lot of this going on you know it's it's white people's fault because of this it's and when nobody wants to take responsibility for their own actions you know what i'm saying like we are individuals it doesn't matter what your race is we are individuals we are responsible for ourselves as individuals so um you know if you can divide people man uh and how do you do it by putting bullshit on the news to be white, but I'm fine with it because I'm not allowed to have pride in it. Because the colonizers and the white biggest made white history my business. I ain't never gonna give a damn if you like me. I ain't gonna trip when they stereotype me. I'm a white boy and a white boy like me knows that all lives matter. Fight me when I was younger, they taught me to never see color to treat every man as if he was my brother. But now that we're grown up, we hate one another for all of the ways that we struggle and suffer. They coming for blood and we running for cover. The government wants us divided and dumber, addicted and drunk in the gutter. So we never wake up another Damn, another. what did I say? The, you know, what is, what is he talking about there? The government wants us divided, he want, they want us dumb, right? They want us reliant on them. Um, and, and, you know, <sighs> trip when they stereotype me, I'm a white boy and a white boy like me knows that all lives matter. Fight me when I was younger, they taught me to never see color to treat every man as if he was my. And I, yeah, like he said right there, I remember when I was a kid, man, like that's what we were taught to like not see color. Like that wasn't an issue, you know, like we all played together and we were taught like that's what we were taught. But now it's like the, oh, that's all they want you to see, you know? And right there, that line for all the ways that we struggle too. It's like we're all in this crazy ass world together. We're all struggling, man. There, there is a lot of us all struggling. Just because the struggles may be a little different here, maybe a little different there, doesn't mean we're not struggling. We're in this shit together. Let's be aware of that. Coming for better, we run it for cover. The government wants us divided and dumber, addicted and drunk in the gutter, so we never wake up and never recover. Call me culture vulture because I rap good. I don't pop tans or smoke backwoods, but they call me a wigger and label me Hitler and hate like I'm wearing a clan hood. It ain't left or right or black or white. It's good and evil. I leave folks hate normal people. United we stand and divide and we fall. America, we gotta get real. You were segregated. That was not fair. You were enslaved. They did not care. But you were never on a plantation. And my generation was not there. That's trauma in your DNA. Causing what we see today. I pray to God you staying strong. Don't want to see no man in pain. You white folks. I'm in bed. Dang, dude. Like, he, like, he is just pointing. United we stand and divide and we fall. America, we gotta get real. Segregated, that was not fair. You were enslaved, they did not care, but you were never on a plantation, and my generation was not there. That's oh man, 
Y'all, y'all heard it. That was not fair. You were enslaved. They did not care. But you were never on a plantation. And my generation was not there. That's trauma in your DNA. Causing what we see today. I pray to God you staying strong. Don't want to see no man in pain. You white folks are embarrassed. Some of y'all are such parents. That prejudice you inherited was racism from your parents. Get that poison out your veins. Whites and blacks are all the same. They want us in. I, okay, so I really like that. Both He's calling on both sides of the fence. I really like that, man. I can't. I'm getting stoked for Adam's uh, Adam's verse, man. I'm getting super stoked for it. But, like, you, you got to call out both sides of it, man. You know, like, you know, who who's more racist? The individual who goes about his life and just lives his life and lets, lets other people do what they got to do regardless of how he feels about them? Or the individual who's saying that black folks can't rise up and do their own thing and take care of their own and do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, they are strong people. We're all strong people. We're all human beings. We've all suffered. I go back to what I was saying earlier. We all suffer. So. See no man in pain. You white folks are embarrassed. Some of y'all are such parents. That prejudice you inherited was racism from your parents. Get that poison out your veins. Whites and blacks are all the same. They want us in our graves. Just let me try to explain. I swear they want us in a race for They do every day for whose lives matter more. Wow. I won't be dying in the race for our government is paid for because our lives matter more. Oh, so here we're here. We're coming up with uh, Adam's verse here. Uh, as far as. Musically in the chorus goes, I don't think it's as, as strong as they could have made it. That's for sure. But um, the substance is in the verses, right? And they just you need the chorus to kind of tie it all together and sum it up. Our lives matter more. All right, let's go, man. Let's go, Adam. If you born black, you lose. Might as well go get that. You gon' die before you 25. Get shot over your shoes. You gon' get killed by police even when you follow the rules. If you listen to the news, you gon' believe all this is true. true. Or what was I saying earlier? What was I saying earlier? Like this is what the news is peddling to people. You gon' die before you 25 get shot over your shoes. You gon' get killed by police even when you follow the rules. If you listen to the news, you gon' believe all this is true. Damn. What was I saying? What was I saying, folks? This is exactly what I was saying, man. This, you guys heard it, man. You like, you know, feeling like they need, you know, people like, uh, was it, uh, I forget the word he used there, but, uh, you know, like I'm not, it's not my job to like virtue signal. You know what I'm saying? Like, People can take care of their own. And if they need help, they'll ask. And I'll be more than willing to help anybody who needs it, man. It's just that that's it right now. what they all call me. Cis white male, bigot racist, he's a Nazi. That's not me. I'm not one of these white liberal commies who think black America needs allies and they on me. Your neighborhood's all gay and claim you pro black, but you faking guys are dying on the pavement. All your hats. I love that he's call he's calling him he's calling it all out, dude. He's like, oh, you you're your community is gated, man, but you, you know, preaching this, that, and the other about, you know, um, white privilege. Again, we are all struggling in this motherfucker, man. We are all struggling in this motherfucker. On the pavement, all your hashtags won't save them. That ain't gangster. People begging for their life still. I know white people who can't afford to pay their light bill. Who might feel like they the ones who lose in their life. When the worst thing you could be is not ashamed to be white. White privilege is a system they position for division. If you black, you go to prison. If you white, your life is different. See, and that's truly, like, I believe it, man. Like, I don't believe that that's a thing. Like, we all have an equal opportunity to succeed in here. There are people of many different colors who have way more money than me, and there are people of many different colors who have way less money than me, vice versa. You see what I'm saying? It's about what you get out of it. It's about what you put into it. It's it, That's what it's all about. It don't matter who you are. 
uh, as long as you like this shit is hard. It is difficult. Like life is difficult. Getting up and going to work every day is fucking difficult. Ask anybody. You got to go look at the comments section on, you know, Richmond North of Richmond reaction. And you'll see that life is fucking hard. You know what I'm saying? But we're all in this together, which is what we need to rally around. Every color turns to bones when you bury them. That's it, man. Color turns bones one day when you bury them. Whites and blacks are all the same. They want us in our grave. Just let me try to explain. I swear they want us in a race for dying every day for whose lives matter more. Whoa. I won't be dying in the race for a government is paid for because our lives matter more. Whoa. That's facts. Should be us against them, but it's you against me. Ain't nobody gonna win. Everybody gon' see that the color of your skin don't change the color that you bleed. I swear, yeah, man, man. get it, bro. Get it, damn. I say I say Adam fucking got it on that that uh, that course or that uh, bridge. He, he got it on that bridge. There it is, man. Race War by Tom McDonald and Adam Calhoun off the Brave Two album, man. A lot of substance there in the lyrics, man. A lot of truth being spoken. Uh, guys, do me a favor. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the song, the, the substance, and all of that, what I said. Let's start that conversation down below. Let's be nice about it. Also, uh, if you guys like this sort of thing, do me a favor. Hit the sub button, all that good stuff down below. Y'all know what to do with it, man. But holy shit, dude. There's a lot there. And... Uh, uh, yeah, I, I, the, I think the beat was great. The chorus uh, or the uh, verses were phenomenal. The chorus, I think, kind of lacked at least it, in, in the kind of delivery and punch that I was looking for. But again, you got to have the chorus to sum it up, and that's what they did. Uh, so ultimately, they did their job. Um, but with that being said, guys, that's my reaction. Thank you so much for watching. Again, let me know down below all that good stuff. Thank you guys. I love all of you guys. Remember, stay nuclear. Peace. <laughs>